Wait lang po, ang saya lang yan. Yung dalawang kulang. Yung nandito tayo lahat, sige, inuman na siya may damuhan. Uulitin natin yan. Tanda niya, uulitin natin yan. Magre-reunion tayo, kaya get ready mga isan. Welcome back to my channel everyone. Today is a very special day because I'm taking you along on my first travel to Hawaii. But it's not just any ordinary travel, it's a journey filled with mixed emotions. I'll be meeting my nieces and nephews for the first time and they all grown up. Reconnecting with cousin and aunties and feeling grateful for the opportunity to bond with them. Reminiscing about the past and saying goodbye to a dear cousin. Join me as I navigate through a roller coaster of feelings against a beautiful backdrop of Hawaii. Let's dive in. Touchdown Hawaii! The first thing I did was to call my mom and hubby to let them know I arrived safely. At the airport, I was picked up by my beautiful cousin, Ate Minette. We headed straight to her place while waiting for her mom, my tita, who's coming from a checkup. We had lunch together and we were catching up for a bit. I was able to see my cousin too, Kuya Von, my nieces and nephews. It's been a while since I've seen them and they're grown up so much. The next day, my cousin took me to the Four Seasons Hotel, a luxurious five-star hotel in Hawaii. We enjoyed some coffee and tried their vegetarian burritos. They were absolutely delicious. You guys should definitely give them a try. Siyempre, picture time, kaya excited. Okay. After taking pictures, we wandered around and walked to the hotel to see what was there. We did all of this, and then my two daughters, whenever their plants were dying, we would make them grow again. This is all my collection. This is my collection. I love it. This is very nice. I love it. It's nice. Aww. That was the last place that me and Jeff had a conversation in that area. This is the On my first night I stayed at my cousin Ate Jen's place. Since it was my first time at their house, Ate Minette joined us for the sleepover. And we spent the entire evening chatting. We fondly reminisce about our childhood. Ate Jen, being the eldest cousin, she took care of us when we were kids. She din pala yung ate ng pinsan ko na si Jeff, who is with, kid, with God now. That night was filled with reminiscing. punong puno lang ng masasayang ala-ala. It's harvest time. Three years, yeah, three years old pa lang yan. Ah, three years old yeah. pa lang. See? I know. Ano, 20 feet tall. Oh. Si Malunga yun at saka ito, Goyobano. Oh, did you show her the Goyobano? Goyobano. Ate Jen, my cousin, inherit her gardening skills from our grandma. It turns out she and her husband were the only ones who work on their backyard. It was truly a labor of love. Nakaka-inspire, di ba? Ito ng grandma namin. Tingnan mo na. Ang, ang ganda ng neighborhood nyo, te. Na-appreciate ko nung bumaba ko. Now, let me introduce you to Jeffrey's eldest child, Jalen. And that's the brother, brother right there. Say hi. Tell them your name. Um, my name is Jacob. Um, the reason why she's here today is because um, it's kind of sad because um, my dad passed away. Mm -hmm. This is not my original plan. It's not. Yeah, it's not her original plan to come, but like, come here, yeah. you know, 
My dad's so nice that everybody's coming. Look. Baby, baby. Here are all my nieces and nephews along with my cousins. Today is a day of my cousin Jeff's viewing. My aunts are also here. My niece Jalen and nephew Jacob also sang for their dad during the service. It's heart-wrenching. My cousin suddenly had a flashback of how he was to us, his cousins. He's the type of person who always laughs and is never stingy. He's close to all his cousins because he's such a kind-hearted person. He's like a brother to us as well. Hi to my titas and titas. Hello from Hawaii. Nice. Well, I hope to finally meet you someday. I met Tita Ma'an. I can't wait to see everybody. Bye. Hi, Shane. <laughs> Hi, everyone. Mga pamangkin. I love you. Welcome to Hawaii. <laughs> The day after my cousin's chef viewing, my aunts and cousins decided to take us along with the kids on a tour around the island. We had an amazing time starting with picnic on the beachfront. It was so much fun especially hearing all the stories and reminiscing about the good old days. It brought back memories of when I was younger and we'd all have a blast together, laughing and making memories. I couldn't help but laugh when I remembered whenever my aunts visited the Philippines, my cousins and I would eagerly compete to claim their pasalubong or packages they brought with them. <laughs> Yung tipong agawan talaga kami magpipinsan. It was always a hilarious scramble. Our adventure culminated in a seafood feast at a local restaurant where we savored every bite and shared plenty of laughter. Afterward, we explored the vibrant strip and took a leisurely stroll through the mall. Thanks for this day, I really appreciate it. Uh, <laughs> uh, 
salukuyang... Uh, Ewan ko sa'yo, Kuya. Bakit ka wala? Laban na nakapot ka ka, Amerikano. Ako'y pinakagwapo. Nasa pa natin ako, Kuya. Isiset natin to sa mga pinisan natin para feminist tayo. Ito na kayo rito. Kapasama tayo. Hindi tayo minaw mga ito. Yung dalawang kulang. Yung nadinito tayo lahat. Sige, inom mo na siya may damuhan. Uulitin natin din natin yan. Magre-reunion tayo. Kaya get ready mga isan. Ayan, ganyan. Dali ako may sasakyan. Hello, man. Be safe tomorrow. Ingat. Take care. Naiyak na ako. I love you. I love you all. I'm leaving tomorrow. I'm gonna miss you guys. I'm gonna cry now. I wanna cry. You all come back. I'll wait for you in San Diego. You should go to San Diego. Soon. Soon. Love you all. Promise. Love you, love you, mom. Love you, Tita. Tita Donna, Tita Banji, Ate Minette, Ate Jen. My nephews and nieces. Love you all. Ate, gusto ko mag-coffee. Manalayo siya sa liling kape. Akin na lang yan. Sending a heartfelt thank you to my incredible relatives who graciously hosted me during my time in Hawaii. Your warm hospitality made my stay unforgettable and I'm immensely grateful for all the wonderful memories we created together. Headed back to San Diego now, missing my hubby and kids. Can't wait to see them. It's been four days away. <laughs> <laughs>